What's going on everybody? It's Warhawk and welcome to Nerf Talk. We got a video for you here because we have done some thrifting runs and we got ourselves quite the haul. Yeah, it's been a couple of months now since our last thrifting video and like I said, we've done quite a few runs and found some pretty good finds. Let's check it out. Now first off for $1.99, I got this blaster. It's a T-Rex blaster and it doesn't really shoot Elite Darts that well yet. I am going to try and fix that problem, but it doesn't fire him too bad. And of course when you pull the trigger on this blaster, it makes that classic dinosaur sound. For the price of $2.99, I found this Dart Zone Convert Ops, or Covert Ops, and I'm not really sure the name of this one, um, but I found it buried underneath a bunch of stuffed animals, because I saw this piece kind of sticking out, and I was kind of, what is that? And I've never seen this blaster before, so when I saw for $2.99, I was not going to pass it up. Now, if you're like me and when you're thrifting, when you see these kind of blasters, you grab them no matter what. I'm talking about Rebel Blasters. For the price of $2.49, I found this Heartbreaker bow. And I love these bows because they actually operate like a bow. Just love this bow. And for the price of $2.99 each, I found these Rebel Pink Crushes. And I love these little single shot blasters because the trigger pulls really nice and they got tack rails on the top. And for the price of $3.99 each, two Nerf Rebel Guardian Crossbows. $3.99 each for Guardian Crossbows. That both work really well. Was not going to pass that up. And for the price of $3.99, a clear deploy. You know what? I do have uh, a couple of these already, but it's just when I see a clear depo deploy or a sonic deploy, I'm going to have to pick it up just because it's a clear or sonic deploy. Just the way I am as a collector. And I thought for $3.99, couldn't go wrong. And for the price of $2.99, I picked up a 2.0 Commander. Um, these are not bad little pistols, but the thing about them is you can't really take them apart because they're glued together, but they do operate okay, and for the price of them, brand new is alright, but for $2.99, I wasn't going to pass it up. Now this next one, I'm kind of considering a thrifting treasure just, of, just because of what it is and for the price I paid for it. $2.99 I picked up a rival Helios with the mag and a few rounds inside it. Now this one was kind of buried underneath a whole bunch of other toys. The thing I saw was this sticking out and I was like that looks like a rival mag and when I pulled it out, out came the Helios. $2.99 for a working Helios, not a bad deal. Now this next one I am calling a thrifting treasure as well. Take a look at this. A strife with all the attachments, $4.99. I was like, when I saw the price on this, I was like, no, that can't be right. There has to be another sticker on here. And you know what, there wasn't. I brought it home, put some batteries in it, and when you know it, works just fine. And for the price of $6.99, an Elite Hyper Fire. Now, I do have a bunch of these already. I don't know what it is about Hyper Fires and when I'm thrifting. I just can't walk by them, see a price for $6.99 and not pick it up. Put some new batteries in it. Not too bad. And this next one I am also calling a thrifting treasure because I found myself a rival Reaper, an Overwatch Reaper. Now, best thing about it, I only paid $2.99 for it. Now this we found, actually, uh, Jay was with me when we were thrifting and he actually saw this grip sticking out. I walked right by it. I didn't even see it. And he's like, hey, 
did you not see this grip? I'm like, what? And he pulls it out and he, uh, he's like, this. And I'm like, no, how much? $2.99. Now, the only thing about it is when I load it, it's having a problem feeding them up. See? So I have to kind of tilt it to its side and then it'll work. But $2.99 for a Reaper, you can't go wrong with that. And for the price of $5.99, I got myself a Nitro Long Shot. $5.99 for a Nerf Thrifted Blaster. Eh, a little pricey, but it's a Nitro Blaster. And the nice thing about it, got me a Nitro Car here. Load it up. And away it goes. I love Nitro Blasters. I wish I had a few more. So when I find them thrifting, they're coming home. And for the price of $5.99, a Nerf Thunder Blast. Now, cool thing about this, don't have one. Second thing, it shoots Nerf Rockets. And anything for $5.99 that shoots Nerf Rockets, I'm all in. For the price of $6.99, a big bad Dark Tag Swarm Fire. Now the cool thing about this is I don't own one of these and when I saw it I was glad to see it was only $7. Uh, I did bring it home, did put some new batteries in. Works really well. Love these blasters. And for the price of $3.99, a Nerf Firefly. Now, I know this is an older blaster, and I do have another one of these, just not this color. And you know what? When you find an older Nerf blaster thrifting for $3.99, you gotta take it home. So there we go, everybody. That has been my Nerf thrifting finds for the last couple months. Like I said, I didn't want to bring you along for the journey because that would have been a very long video. So let me know in the comments below if you have found some really cool thrifting uh, treasures out there. Even if it isn't Nerf, have you found something that you weren't expecting to find? Leave it in the comments below. Make sure to leave that like everybody because it helps out our channel a lot. Make sure to subscribe if you're checking us out for the first time and always have fun with those blasters. <laughs>